Hello guys and welcome to the first episode in my Go.C Sharp how to series. In this episode, we will learn how to get the assigned key in code from the input map. So first, let's create the main scene. Right click the node and click on the attach script and change this to C Sharp script and click create. We have the code here, we'll get to it soon. And now click on product, product settings, click on the input map, and let's create our own key. Let's say we wanna have our jump key. And click on add. And let's assign the key to this guy. Let's use spacebar and click okay. And click on close. Let's bring up the code here. And let's remove some junk in here. Okay, let's create a new method. Public string get assigned input event key. And we're gonna give the action name and then check for the key that is assigned. All right, so first let's get the actions here and use the input map here and get the action list here which is a collection. I'm going to get our action that we passed in. Then we just have to loop through all of these guys here. Var A in actions. And then we want to pipe cost this to an input event key. A as input event key. Like so. Just make sure that the key is not null here, that we actually got something. And I'm going to return the always dot get scan code string here. The key dot scan code. And if everything else fails, we can just return. No key is assigned. Because we have multiple input devices. You can have, for instance, a mouse or you can use your gamepad. So in this case, we're just checking for the keys. All right. So let's get this guy running. Print. We're going to find the action here. We're going to grab the jump key action here. We're going to print that to the console. Okay. So let's run this guy. Oh, okay, we haven't saved the scene, so scene, save scene. And then we can play it. Select the current one. And in the output, we get the space key. All right, so let's change this guy as well. Project, product settings. Let's change this to another key. Say we want to have the Q key for jump. Okay, and close. And we can now run. And we get the Q key. So this is how you get the assigned key from the input map. All right. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.